Alright, we are here at the beach to try and get some yummy lunch. We got here really early. I don't know that I've ever spearfished in Hawaii super early. Usually I spearfish more in the afternoon. Today we got out pretty early. We got here at about 7 a.m. Nobody's here. Looks like a great day, calm waters. fishing and I got three fish all three of them very delicious fish and then I found a grill on the beach and just kind of smoked them for about 10 minutes very excited so let's uh, dig in and see so this fish I've been trying to catch one of these for a long time and I finally got one mmm 
delicious. Is it hot enough so I can... Uh, no, it's not too hot. Want to try some? Here, try it, try it. What part is that? What part is it's that? It's the breast. Tastes like chicken. How what? is it? Good? Very much. I want more salt inside. Do you? Mmm. That is, is good. That is good. Where's the salt? Grady, he wants some. Can you get him a little Where's piece? Here, give him that bite. I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll put some more salt on it. This little pink fish is what everyone goes for. Mm. Some salt that on is it. tasty. Mm. Mm. One other piece of that. Very good. I like that fish more. Very good. This one? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's not bad, huh? Take right here. Here's some. Try it. Yeah, it's fish. That's yummy. It's mm. yummy. Want some more, Ange? I just mm -hmm. love it. You know here. how I love it so mm. much. Mm. That mm. is Mama. the life, guys. Mama. What? Mama. That is the life. Do you like it? Uh -huh. Oh, Gray wants more. Ooh, we haven't even tried this other one, guys. I like this pink fish. It's very fatty, though. Not a lot of bones. I've had this one before, and it's pretty good. It's kind of like a bass. Or a bat? Not a bat. Ain't nobody got time for Corona. No. Well, else if we eat a bat, then we will get get coronavirus. So, let's not eat a bat. Do you want more, Gray? Yeah. Gray wants more. Can you get him more, mm -hmm. Dad? I'll get you a big boneless piece. Fish that has scales on it. Oot. Gray and Gray want more. One time, my brother and I it was right when I had started spear fishing, and we were gutting a fish up on the rocks right near the ocean the water would come in and coat the surface of the rocks with water and uh if you get a bone just pull it out and put it on there anyways we were gutting these fish and all of a sudden an eel came out of the water and bit my leg and me and my older brother Josh were just squealing. You have stuff. Scared the crap out of us. There was another eel that we saw coming to try to do the same. It was crazy. The eel came out of the water and bit my leg. I stuck a fish and I I went I went from the top and hit the fish from the top. And that went through the fish and then into the sand at the bottom. And I was totally out of breath. So I just left my gun floating with my pole stuck in the the sand right and the fish was flopping around on it I went down to go and grab it after I had gotten some breath and just as my hand touched the pole to, to or the spear to pull it out of the sand an octopus came out of a rock wrapped its whole body around the fish that was on the pole and then broke the fish in half and pulled the fish right into its little rock crevice it was kind of scary. I wish that Very I cool. That was the that. first time I had ever been spearfishing that happened. Okay. It's never happened to me since.
pretty. We got one for everybody in the family. are called Roy. They're yeah. pretty. They're, uh, they're a grouper that they introduced to Hawaii to have a grouper fish. But they eat about 150 to 50 fish a year. Definitely my favorite way to cook fish. You get a very good smoky flavor and you can always, you know, get it hot enough. It's a lot of fun. It's so fresh that all you need is some salt and pepper and we're gonna try some of these babies out. This one is a new fish that I've never caught before but people love it. And then this one, it's called a veke, which is really yummy. Yep, I've tried this one a lot. It's one of my favorite fish to eat. I wish we had some forks, but we don't. Yeah, we have one more that's cooking, and it's delicious. Right, Dad? Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. That's really good. Dad, yeah, can I say something? Sure. It's definitely a little undercooked, but yeah, all the skin off. that's okay. Yeah. I don't love the skin on this one. Right, Dad? Right. Mm. Good because you can debone it pretty easily. Does that look cooked through on that That's side? That's what I did, yeah. Pretty neat. I don't know what this one's called, but they hang out under all the rocks. That's some good meat. It, the meat looks red like, uh, like a tuna. Or salmon, actually. Kind of tastes like salmon. Very, very good. People love this fish here. It's pretty small. So I've always been hesitant to get it. Guys? Definitely worth it. Really yummy. It's kind of hard to hit without a three prong because they're always right under the rock and you don't want to jack up your spear. So I, I got one outside of the rock today, which is great. 